Welcome back to a brand new video. So today I'm actually here with a long awaited haul for you. I did actually do a 18th birthday haul three years ago now, which is crazy to think. And that video literally blew up. It got over 100,000 views. So I'm back again doing a 21st birthday haul, which I'm not gonna lie, I've been absolutely spoiled this year. I've got so many nice things and I'm so grateful. So just a disclaimer, I'm not trying to brag by any means. I've just had many messages actually requesting this and people actually wanting to see what I got for my birthday. And I like watching these videos myself. But before we get into the video, make sure you like and comment down below and also subscribe to my YouTube channel down below for more. And like normal, I'll leave my Instagram and my TikTok on the screen for you to follow there too. Without further ado, let's get into the birthday haul. I'm going to start with what my parents got me first. Um, but in general, all of like my relatives, aunties, uncles, etc. got they all got me money. So I can't actually show the money, but just a huge thank you for the money. And I'm really, really grateful. Going into the actual gifts I got, I'm going to start with my mum and dad because they absolutely spoiled me this year. Like, spoiled me. So a huge, huge huge thank you to them before i get into all of this so i'll go through the smaller things first and then i'll work my way onto the bigger things because it gets big it gets very very big so the first thing i got was a pair of be able leggings which are my favorite gym brand actually i think they're so comfortable and i just love them they're figure hugging and they actually fit my legs and i'm quite tall so i asked for this like steel blue pair which is just really nice and really stretchy and then I also asked for a black pair, but I accidentally asked for them in like a waffle texture, which I didn't like because they weren't stretchy and didn't fit me. So I'm returning them and getting these in black. Um, but yeah, I've just got the blue to show for now, which I literally love these so much. And they are like my go-to gym leggings and also like weekend leggings as well, because I just chill in them. Then the next thing I got is another top up of my favorite Zara perfume, which it is meant to be a dupe of some like proper designer perfume, but I can't remember what it is. Um, so this is the Zara Rose Gourmand perfume and it's literally like the best affordable perfume. It's like my everyday use. It's only $22.99 and I literally wear this daily. So yeah, happy with that. I need to top up my shelf up there. On the theme of perfume, I also got this Michael Kors Wonderlust perfume, which I got for like, I think my 18th or 17th birthday and I literally love it. You're so distracting. All I can hear is your wrestling of your seats. So I got this for either my 17th or my 18th birthday and I literally love the smell. It just <laughs> stops looking at me. Brian's just sat around in the background really distracting me this time. We'll get to his presence in a bit. So yeah, I got this perfume again, which I literally love and it's actually quite expensive. So I would never buy it myself. I save it for like special occasions. <laughs> He's literally stood behind my screen distracting me. Yeah. Really happy with this top up. I've had the one up there for like two years because I don't want to use it because it's too expensive to replace. And the next thing I got is actually a new MAC lipstick, which I haven't actually got one of these in years, like since I was in school. But I saw this on TikTok and this girl had this really nice lip combo with like just a plain gloss and this underneath of lip liner. And it was it was a vibe, like I really wanted it. So I put it on my birthday list. So I got the MAC Luster Glass lipstick in shade 540 Thanks It's MAC, which is this really nice like little like brownie nude colour. Might not be able to see, but it's so nice. And yeah, I just saw it on TikTok and fell in love with it. This is really nice with like a lip gloss on top. The next thing I got is a top up of my like everyday jeans because I wear jeans like every day to work and they just wear down over time because they just stretch and then they make holes. And I just got a top up of the black Joni jeans. These are like my go-to. So every like a birthday or Christmas, I get a new pair. So like at Christmas, I'll get a blue pair. Then the next thing I got is actually a little Vivian Westford piece, which I'm so happy about this. I literally have wanted these for ages, but I've never like bought them myself. So it comes in this cute little bag in this box as well. And then inside, it's just these gorgeous little cute earrings. I love them so much. They're just so dainty. And I didn't want the big ones because I just think they're a bit too much. So I just got these little small ones. And I've been waiting like three days to actually wear them because of this video. Same with all of these things. I haven't been able to use anything. So yeah, I'm really, really happy with these. These are the smaller sort of charms of the earrings they offer. They do like some big 
logo ones but these are like the smaller dainty ones if there is anything you do want links for i can put the links on the comments so just comment what you need the link for not from my mum and dad this is from my auntie and uncle but they got me this really cool bomb cosmetics 21 candle and i just really love this i just think it's really cool and it smells like really nice citrusy and like sort of like fir tree kind of vibes but yeah love this then the next thing I got is a top up of my favourite Nike socks. I love Nike ankle socks because they have to go with every single shoe I have these days. Um, and I never buy them myself because they are a bit of a rip off to be honest. So I just asked for a big pack of these to wear with the new shoes which I'll get to. Um, but yeah, classic. It's just an essential really. So all of them things were more of my essential stuff. And then we move on to the bigger things which it really just gets a bit insane from now. So another thing to mention is they did actually get me loads of snacks, but I've got a whole snack bag, which is full of everyone's snacks like collectively. So I'll get to that shortly, but they did get me loads of chocolates and bits. So on the theme of shoes first, I'm such a shoe and a bag person for context. I don't, okay, I do have an obsession. So shoes and bags are my thing. I've got so many. So first thing I got is a new pair of Converse because Converse are just the everyday sort of roaming shoes you need and mine are so worn out. I got a little top up of Converse. These are so nice. They're like leather and they're like high tops, but they're also platform as well. So they're going to make me even taller than I am already. But I just like this little bit. It makes it a bit different and leather doesn't get trashed as easy. My other ones are literally all bent and creased and it's just not the vibe. The next thing my parents got me is some New Balance. Classic. I haven't actually jumped on the New Balance phase yet since like Molly Mae brought that in. Not gonna lie, I do love the white and black ones. Like I think they're really cool, really cute. I really think I should have got them, but I so much prefer these. I just think these are so nice. They're like a nice neutral sandy colour and they're called like off-white grey, but they're like, yeah, a little bit beigey. I just thought these were like an all black outfit, some white like ankle socks. I don't know, I just much preferred these because I didn't want to be basic and get the white and black ones, although I do like them. Yeah, really happy with them as well. Like, so happy. The next thing my parents got me is... No way. Well, look, <clears throat> it's Breaking Bad too. The next thing my parents got me is a new Valentino bag. And if you don't know, I love a Valentino bag, I do. It's like Mario Valentino. It's not like the proper Valentino. Um, But I got this gorgeous little beige number. I am obsessed with it. So first of all, it's just like a little shoulder bag. But it's like a good size like it's not some little pathetic shoulder bag i have like this one it's like a proper size and you can fit everything in there and it's just cute i love the little pleated effect it looks like expensive and then it gets even better so you have one little long shoulder strap as well just plain but then you also have this gorgeous little shoulder strap as well which has valentino all across it and then if you strap it on you just have the long strap as well which i think is really good so if you're taking it like out for a long day out you can have it on your shoulder but also strap it across your body if you have all the shopping bags you know but inside the bag is literally humongous there's so much space in it and i don't know i just really love the bag and it... also it's such a good color it'll literally go with everything so yeah this is by far like up there with my favorite bag in my room at the minute i so i thought it was going to stop there I got a box from flannels, which whenever you get a flannels bag, you know it's gonna be good, like you know. This is one of my favorite things I got for my birthday from my parents. It's just so nice and it's so expensive, so I feel so bad, but I'm obsessed with it. Look at this little baby. This is gonna be my new little shopping baby. I just love it. So this is my brand new Marc Jacobs tote bag. I got the small one, well, I asked for the small one, because I didn't really want the big one. I'm much more of a small bag girl. It's just so beautiful. It looks like nothing. Like my parents were like, why am I spending this much money on a bag? But if you don't know, it gets nice. It's just the most beautiful little bag in the world. It also comes with a long strap, so it can be a little crossbody number, you know? And so super grateful for that. Thank you so much. Then the last thing my parents got me was actually a new TV, which is on the wall behind me. Can't show you that, but they got me a new TV for my bedroom because the one I have is from when I was like eight years old. So. Yeah, they really went all out. They really, really, really spoiled me this year. And yeah, there's not much else I can say, but a huge, huge, huge thank you to my mum and dad. They've literally like pulled out the park this year. Besides that, they also took me out to dinner with all my family. They also like gave me like spending money, gave me cake and balloons and everything. So 
they went all out i couldn't be more grateful so next moving on to my sister and her husband jake they actually got me some really thoughtful gifts this year as well for my 21st um so the first one my sister made me a little voucher which it says happy 21st birthday as you know we love doing days out and activities together therefore we thought it'd be nice to give you a voucher so you and hannah can do a day out of your choice so it could be like putt shack going for dinner going for drinks cocktails a show basically doing anything that I want to do and I have a £40 budget for myself to spend. So that's a really thoughtful gift idea because I never know what I want to do. And the next thing she got me is something I actually asked for on my list, which is this cute little stackers box, which I love stackers. It's like the cutest little like jewellery box brand ever. But I've just got the jewellery travel case, the mini one, because I already have like all my jewellery and like organised in my drawers. And I only ever take like two, three rings away with me at one time. Now I've got like more luxury jewellery, which we'll come to in this haul. This is just basically going to be for that stuff when I travel. The other stuff can just go to the bottom of my bag. So it's this cute little grey travel case. It's like, it's quite small, but it's just like for what you need it for. So it's got a little space here for like bracelets and necklaces. And then here you can put like a ring and an earring. So it's just a cute little travel case. And I just love it. It's just... I love it. The next thing I got from my sister and her husband is a little Abbott Lion jewellery piece, which I love a bit of Abbott Lion. I actually have worked with them a few times, so I love seeing their jewellery. Inside, I've got the nicest little bracelet in the world. I think it's part of the edit from Saffron Barker. It's just so, so nice. Let me just see if I can actually find a way to show you. This is the bracelet you probably won't be able to see, but it's like little clovers and it says Lucy on it. I just think it's so cute and it's actually quite sentimental for like a 21st birthday. So it's been personalised and it's like a chromey sort of pearly sort of background to the names and the clovers. So yeah, I just really love it. It's really cute and it's just such a thoughtful gift. And it's not actually something I asked for, which sort of made it a bit more special. So besides from the jewellery and the jewellery case and the like gift voucher to go on a date out, they also got me like chocolate and snacks, which can contribute to my snack bag in a second. So yeah, a huge, huge, huge thank you to you, Hannah and Jay. You spoiled me. Next, moving on to my brother, Matthew, and his girlfriend, Tam. They got me quite an expensive pair of shoes. But first of all, they got me this little keepsake in the card, which is a little happy birthday clover with like a pink sort of band to match this other one she got me from when they went on holiday. Then getting to the real deal. The box is huge because I have big feet. Here, I've got my new favourite little babies. They're just so nice and I just love them. They're so much different to Air Force, which is why they're actually better. So yeah. They're just so nice. And I just really wanted these for a while. I've had my eye on them for literally months and months and months. I just like them because they're not like Air Force. And I always just get basic shoes. So these are actually different for me. It's a bit more of like a different colour. And yeah, these were my Nike socks. with like a sort of casual genie outfit, white top. Five. Huge, huge, huge thank you to Matthew and Tam for these shoes. Because I know they are not cheap. I know how much they are. So a huge thank you. My snack bag. I have got so many snacks in here it's unreal so a lady at work really kindly made me a cheesecake and some kinder bueno cookies on my birthday so that was really really nice and then she also bought me like a whole bag full of snacks these aren't all the snacks these are like some from other people but she got me like pringles my favorite sweets like my favorite chocolate chocolate orange maltesers kinder my favorite like caribou sweets like everything so I've got a whole bag of snacks in here and then also I've got like snacks that my family gave me, so like Maltesers and Kinder and Mother's Creation. So I've got like everything going on in here and also a cute little birthday badge which a lady at work gave me as well. I'm literally going to be fed for days. So next from my bestie Kylie, I got an actual gift bag of gifts again. So first thing I got my favourite brownies, these are literally paying and they come in like a little small pack, see it's actually six in here and you can warm them up in the microwave, they're the best things ever. Then I again got my favourite sweets. I also got a bag of my teasers which I've already eaten, we ate them in the car yesterday. And I got a coconut candle which smells insane. I love a candle in my room. And then my favourite thing by far, basically, if you haven't watched my Christmas hauls and my room tours and everything like Christmas video themed, I am obsessed with a gonk. I don't have any behind me, but at Christmas, I had an obsession with the gonks. Like I had gonk blanket, gonk like 
decorations and stuff, gonk bedding. So yeah, I had a bit of an obsession and she found me this like autumnal gonk blanket and it's like giving me pure Halloween vibes. So this is literally going on my bed. I just had to wait for this video to be done. So I've got a Christmas gonk blanket and then like an autumnal gonk blanket. So literally obsessed with this. So next, moving on to Ryan's parents. Supposedly the main present hasn't come yet. It's in the post. I was there this morning. And also his brother got me a present, which is still in the post as well. So both of them got delayed. So I'm just doing like a part present haul for now because I haven't got the other ones yet. So here I've got this gorgeous smelling hamper with my two birthday cards from his brother and his mum and dad. So I've got this hamper. So first of all, I got a pink donk, which has my name on. So it's just feeding my gonk obsession. And then here, I've just got the ribbon which tied it up. A body wash, a bath salts, body lotion, and the diffuser set. And then in here, there's like some chocolate truffles as well. And then here, it's like a really, really pretty key ring actually, which is pink, which I'm actually loving pink at the minute. So it's just like that. So this is all from Osprey. So yeah, it's just a really cute little hamper. And she wrapped it up like really nicely for me. It had a nice ribbon. She made her own like pom-poms. She made this herself, his mum. And it's got like a little keychain here with all the L and the 21 and my birthday on here so she just always goes so far to make the extra touches which is really really nice so yeah I haven't got the other gift from Brian's parents or the gift from Ryan's brother yet but so far really happy with this so huge thank you to Brian's parents the next thing I got is from my grandma which she literally went ham she really really spoiled me and she really didn't need to do that I like I didn't expect this from her at all so she actually got me something from Guess, which I've wanted this for ages. It's so nice. So in the bag, I've got another bag. So it's this really gorgeous white bag bag. So it's basically like this. It's just really, really cute. So this, I think you can actually take off. I might put this on my keys um, or you can put this on here as well. It depends how much you want in, on it. A little zip on the back and then the logo on the front. But it's also, again, a really good size and it's just really practical. I love a big shoulder bag with like a big strap as well. And then inside, just like the other bags, really, really spacious. So it's literally just so good. I love this bag so much. And they had it in so many nice colours as well, like a blue, a pink, a purple. But yeah, my grandma literally spoiled me this year. So a huge, huge, huge thank you to my grandma. My last gifts, I actually... I'm moving on to Ryan now. So obviously, like I said, all my aunties and uncles, they all got me loads of cash. So I'm really, really grateful to all of them. They literally spoiled me. But moving on to what Ryan got me, because he literally spoiled me so much this year. He went literally ham. So first thing he got me was gifts, which I opened on the birthday. So first he got me this jelly cat, which I've always, always, always wanted. For the last like two months, I've been obsessing over it. And I literally love it. It's called Clarissa the Cloud. And it's the most fluffy and pretty thing. And it literally suits my room. It can sit anywhere. But yeah, I've just really, really, really wanted a jelly cat for ages and I literally love it. So I'm so glad he bought it for me so I can stop moaning about it. And then on my birthday, I actually opened a little Tiffany bag from him. And yeah, I couldn't really believe it when I saw it. I just don't know why I had to spend this much. But yeah, he got me a little gift note in a Tiffany bag. And then he actually got me the little beaded bracelet to match my necklace, which I got for my 18th from my mum. This is the bracelet he got me. You can see just the like beaded heart bracelet and it's so nice but i know it's so expensive so it kills me that he did this for me but yeah i'm so grateful and it's so pretty and so dainty i just love it and also it's like i love it more because it matches my necklace so it's like a complete little set this is so grateful and then we actually went on a day out the day after my birthday on the friday to london so he surprised me with a full-on day out and the first thing he did to me, we went into London and we were like walking around Bond Street. Then we walked past a Gucci shop and he was like, yep, let's go in. And then he just asked the lady to do a collection. And I was like, okay, right, I'm getting something from Gucci. So I actually walked out with this Gucci bag, which is my first ever Gucci belonging. And I feel so bougie, like so, so, so bougie. And yeah, we literally walked around with a Gucci bag all day and I've never felt so important in my whole life. So inside I've got this Gucci little like tote shopper bag and then I kept it all wrapped up for this video. Literally obsessed with it. So, like, even the packaging, it's just so bougie. I literally am obsessed with it. And then inside, I've got the Gucci heart ring, which it's so pretty. I literally love it. And I've wanted it for ages as well. 
It is the nicest thing ever. I just needed it. And again, I know how expensive this is, along with a Tiffany. It's just so much money and I'm so, so grateful. Um, but yeah, I literally got this ring and I didn't know what to do with myself. I was so happy. He got me this ring, the Tiffany bracelet and the cloud, but then he also took me on a day out to London. So after we got the Gucci ring, he took me up to a bar in London, like a rooftop bar called Bocan. And then he took me to like around Canary Wharf. We went to a farm in Canary Wharf, saw like loads of llamas. And then we went to dinner like on the riverfront. So yeah, it was a really nice like steak restaurant. We had like a fresh like steak burger. It was so nice. So yeah, he really, really spoiled me for my 21st. So a huge, huge, huge thank you to Ryan. So that is everything I got for my 21st birthday. And I just want to say I am so, 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 so grateful to everyone who got me something and everyone who wished me happy birthday as well. It was literally the best day. I had the best day ever. I mean, I was at work in the morning, but I had the whole bank holiday weekend to live up to my 21st birthday life. I am so grateful to everyone who got me something and anyone again who wished me a happy birthday. Again, I'm not trying to brag, I'm simply just showing everyone what I got for my birthday. I had a few requests and I love these videos to watch myself. So that is everything for this video. If you've made it this far, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel down below for more and follow me over on my socials, which I'll leave in the description down below. But yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!